Hi everyone, welcome to our channel, Rebecca Stu and the crew. I'm Rebecca and today's Friday, so it means it's time for another weekly What is New at the Dollar Tree this week video for the week of Friday, June 11th, 2021. All of the pictures from the Dollar Trees that I went to this week are from the Dallas-Fort Worth area in Texas. So let's go shopping. Apparel and accessories will be first. They had the Juncture brand sandals back in this week in the pastel and tan colors. They're really pretty. They have them in adult and children's sizes. They also have a bunch of their summertime scarves restocked and they match a lot of the bucket hats that they've had out recently. Then they had their three pack of socks with the fold over cuffs in adult and children's sizes and the bright and pastel colors. They also had a new eye mask geared towards wedding parties. They had the one that says wifey, maid of honor, bridesmaid, and miss to missus. Over in arts and crafts this week, they had a ton of new stickers. I love the farmhouse one with the little trucks and all different colors. They had hearts with the buffalo plaid motif. And then I thought this sticker pack was the same, but it is a little bit different. They have cows, milk cans, and a few signs that say homemade with love. So those are different. They also have this pack of stickers. It's double-sided. It has all the different labels that you could put in your kitchen and pantry. I thought that was really neat. There's quite a few stickers there with everything you would need to organize. And then they had a bunch of just different uh, sticker packs this week that I'll just let you scan through here. Now, these stickers are double-sided. And so the stickers you see on this one side, you get two of each sticker because they're exactly the same on the other side of the sheet. Then um, quite a few of these stickers, like the one that says Girl Power, they have... Um, a few different ones with like flowers and uh, succulents and things like that. They also have matching extra large stickers that we'll see here in just a minute. And those are to decorate like your laptop and things like that. And those larger stickers, you get six in each set. So we'll see those in just a second. I wanted to make sure you guys got to see all of the new sticker sets that they had out. because They had quite a few out this week. So here are the larger stickers that you see here. You get six, it's like three on each side. And they're just a larger version of like one or two stickers on each one of those uh, sheets that I, sh I showed you guys with the smaller stickers on them. A lot of them have like motivational sayings and things like that. It says they're good to decorate like mirrors, laptops, um, decals for the car and things like that. So they're a nice big sticker. They're really nice. I think they're made really well. They also had a bunch of their stencils restocked. Some of them look a little bit new, like this one here with the different uh, backgrounds that you can do. So this stencil square, you get four different backgrounds that you can paint. It is the plastic reusable stencil. And then they also had um, a lot of repeat ones. Uh, the one with the feathers, the travel, which has a bunch of different things that um, are geared towards travel. They had one with hearts on it and all the hearts have like a different pattern on the heart. And, um, you know, just quite a few. So they had one with flowers. I didn't show all of them, but I did show a few on each wheel here. So you can see, uh, you know, just some of the cutouts and the pictures that they have they have quite a few of those and they do restock those from time to time sometimes they get new ones but lately they've been pretty much the same ones that they've had but they did have this one which i don't remember it has all the different motivational sayings on it and there are four different ones in this stencil wheel as well then this week they had some new galvanized metal icons you get three in each piece they're pretty large they're about the same size as you would expect the wood cut out so they had a flower a star you could also get the hearts 
And then they had clouds, which I thought were really cute. And then to go along with these four stands that I showed you guys last week, they, this week they had a tulip on a stand. You could get a tree. And then they also had the house. And then my personal favorite, which was the mason jar. They also had their galvanized metal uh, letters and numbers back in this week. And um, you get 13 letters in each pack. They had the... Um, soda bottle lids and these galvanized metal plaques with the corrugated look they also had some transfer tape that will fit a cricket joy so that was new this week and they brought back the crafter square glue glitter sticks in the gold and silver they also had the eileen's instant tacky sheets that are double-sided and the wood carving sets they restocked all of their canvas, the stretched and the flat panels, and the deco mesh um, tube. They had that tubing in all the different colors. If you saw last week's video, they had these stones in different colors. I found them at the register. This week, I found several bins at different Dollar Trees filled with them. They had the wagon wheel wreath frames back in and the awareness ribbon frames. Then I found the um, succulents on the clips to um, make wreaths and things with. They had a bunch of floral restocked and the deco mesh in the pastel colors. They also had the slime balls with the recipe to make slime included. Over in the baby section this week, they had their baby blankets restocked and they also had matching uh, bibs to go with those. They're like the bandana bib style and they match all of the blankets. They're double-sided, but they do not have like the plastic on the back. It's more of like a terry cloth feel. Last week I showed they had a bunch of the onesies at a few of the Dollar Trees. I found them at more of the stores this week, so those are definitely making their rounds. And then they have a bunch of the grip socks. You get one for a dollar, but it's nice to find the socks with the grips on the bottom because they don't have those all the time. So over in Health and Beauty, we'll start with cosmetics first this week. So they had restocked these bags with the uh, metallic look. I found it in the silver and the gold. They had their icy cherry lip balm flavor. You get two in a pack for a dollar and the Airheads watermelon. They had some more of the L'Oreal infallible metallic um, eyeshadow palettes. And then in the hair care, they had these three extra large scrunchies, which are a great buy for a dollar. And then the snap clips with the pearls, you could get the rectangle or the teardrop shape. They had uh, the light pink, a mint green, it's kind of like a um, magenta pinkish purple color. And then they also had it in the off-white in the gold. They had some small headbands geared more towards like a two-year-old. So those are really tiny for little, uh, little ones. Over in the pharmacy and personal care, they had the secret freshness on the go deodorant. It's a nice small, it looks like an EOS tube you can throw in your book bag or purse. And the new bottles of the Tag Sports body wash for men. So they had those in the 14 ounce bottles. Then they had the Crabtree and Evelyn avocado olive oil and basil ultra moisturizing hand therapy lotions. Or you could get the bath salts and the hibiscus rose and chamomile cucumber. They also restocked the spa therapy exfoliating facial loofahs. You get six in a pack. They come super thin, but when you add water to them, they get really puffy. I absolutely love these. So if you haven't tried them out, I highly recommend them. Over in the fun finds this week, they had these tall top hats. They're for like um, tailgating and things like that. I only found them in the gray and black, and it says one size fits most. They had the prayer boxes restocked, which is a really popular item in our Dollar Tree. They have these little tins. They're super cute. You lift them up, and inside it has a Bible verse. They're all different. It comes with a matching notepad and mechanical pencil, which match the lid on the tin. Then they had these small miniature paper clips with the tassels or the pom-poms. Usually they have a larger version, but they had out the miniature sizes this week. They also had some new puffy stickers, which were the Jojo Siwa brand, which I know are really popular with the younger kids. And next we'll go over into home decor to see what is new this week. They had quite a few new things that I thought were really 
neat that I'd love to show you. So in the home decor, they had some new candles this week, which were so pretty. And the scent was just amazing. I love the tag on the front. They're very decorative. So this blue candle here, that was called the Tropical Fiesta. You can also get the red one, which is one of my favorites. It was the salted watermelon scent. Or you could also get the banana blossom. And then my second favorite, which was the pineapple punch. They had their candle wax warmers in a larger size than they usually carry. So here's a view of the side of them. As you can see, they're a little bit bigger than the ones Dollar Tree usually has. And then they've had these candles off and on for the last few months, but they did just restock these at every Dollar Tree I went to this week. The blue one is called Turquoise Tides. The light tan or taupe colored one here, the scent for that one is the Palo Santo. You'd also get the gray which has like a marble look to it a little bit. That one is called Healing Stone. And then the green one is called Mineral Mist. They had some stretched canvas magnets to say, rest your mind, calm your heart, free your soul. Or this one that says, my happy place with the sea turtles. And they had some of their ceramic magnets to say it wasn't me on the dog bone. And you could also get the uh, rectangle that says stay magical with the paw prints, or you can get the circular one that says stay positive. They also had this one that says, I love you pretty much with the whiskers down the side or the one with the cat ears that just says meow. The last magnet that I found this week was this one that says, every snack you make, every meal you bake, every bite you take, I'll be watching you. They had these glass figurines in the hands making different hand gestures. And they brought back these uh, rugs, which they've had these little carpets for off and on for over a year now. They're so fantastic. When they first came out, they sold out like crazy. They were really hard to find, but thankfully they brought these back several times and are a little bit easier to get each time. They come in four different colors. You can also get these small jars with the lids. They remind me of like a little honey jar. I think they'd be fun to paint. Then I found these wall, uh, plaques with the hooks on them in the white and gold. They had some farmhouse signs. I found two different ones, but I believe there were a few other ones, just they were already gone by the time I had gotten there to get the pictures this week. They had the candle votives with the starfish on them, which were so cute. I love the starfish. It's got like a, um, a little bit of a bling to it tied on with the twine. Then they had these picture frames with the raised upward at the bottom. It has like a 3D look to it, as you can see here from the side view. And then to put the picture on the sign, it just has this little clip over on the left. So there's four different ones. They all have different sayings. You can either hang them on the wall or you can use the little easel to set those up on the tabletop. Up next, they had these tabletop calendars that come with the little blocks that you can flip over to put the dates. The idea of the can of the calendars are not new, but the actual pictures and decor of them are. So this week they had the today's a good day. Uh, grace uh, running on grace and coffee you could also get the house that says family blessed home and then the last one here which has the mountain range and the sun in the background it says focus on the good so they're similar to ones they've had in the past but definitely a new decoration in the back they've also had some more of the trinket trays and over in housewares home maintenance and electronics this week they had the paracord on these holders which I thought were nice when you're done using them there's like this uh kind of like a corrugated top that you can take the end and stick it in the side to help it hold it so it doesn't completely unravel so I like the holder for those they also had the sterilite bins in the clear and in the black those are the smaller sized bins or you could get these um, different paper trays and things in the pastel colors they usually put these out around back to school time so i was surprised to see them out right now they did have quite a few of those and then these larger bins which match the buckets and things i showed you guys last week i also found these wash packs for shoes um i actually bought one i'm going to try it on my son's shoes you get three in a pack for a dollar, they had the removable hooks with the wood grain look. 
two in that packet for a dollar. And then they also had their Rust-Oleum Rock Guard spray paint in the crystal clear at a few more of the Dollar Trees this week. Over in the kitchen and pantry, they had restocked this uh, gold tray. So sometimes they sell it in silver and red. Just the gold ones are out right now. You could also find these tumblers with these white clear plastic lids that snap on. I thought they screwed on, but they do just snap on top. And then the lid is just the slide open and close lid. And those come in four different colors. They also had the V8 Sparkling Energy Strawberry Kiwi drinks. Or you could get it in the Sparkling Energy Lemon Lime or Orange Pineapple flavor. They had the Special K pastries in the strawberry. You get four in a pack for a dollar. And then these Sun Best Fiber Boost uh, snacks. They're 90 calories. I believe they're a play on the um, Fiber One bars that you can get, which are also 90 calories. Uh, they had the Planters Peanuts and the Salted Caramel flavor, or you could get the star snacks and the toffee peanuts. Then they had some of the instant pudding mix and the Dove brand. They had milk chocolate or the peanut butter milk chocolate. They also had the Skippy peanut butter bites and the graham cracker flavor. Some of the Betty Crocker Kisses Blossom cookie kit. Everything you need comes in the box except for the eggs and the butter, or you can get the no-bake cookie bites and the snickerdoodle flavor over in the home office library and teaching tree section they had these adorable pencil pouches they're about an eight by ten inch size they had them in the lemon and the watermelon those are the jot brand so cute they also had these pencil pouches it had like a geometric animal face on them i thought those are really neat as well you can also find the jot brand extra large glue sticks in the two packs if you compare to the normal size glue sticks you can see how big those actually are for a dollar and the cloth desk organizer sets they've had out the last few weeks they had some more of those out this week or you could find the magnetic boxes in the three different colors with the clear lid. They also had these new pencil boxes in three different colors. They're a hard plastic with an iridescent kind of hollow graphic um, film on the outside of them. And you get them in the pink. It's almost a peach color, lime green, or this the really soft baby blue. They also had these three pack of plastic bins in in the teaching tree section, or you could get these really nice bins with the snap on lids. They have them in three different colors. They're the rectangle sizes. Um, a few weeks ago, maybe a month ago now, they had the taller ones where you could actually fit like an index card in them, like a whole pack of them. They were quite large, but this week they just had the longer rectangular size boxes. I also found the Jot brand notepads in the three pack that come in three different colors. I like that they have the ruled side on the one end there or you can get these new brush tip markers they come three to a pack you can either get the red orange and yellow or the green blue and purple and those all of course have the brush tip on the end of the marker I also found these metallic ink pens I kind of wanted to buy them but I really didn't need another ink pen I thought they were really neat. So the color of the pen dictates the color of the ink and it says the ink is metallic if anyone buys those and tries them, let me know how they work. I was really drawn to those. Then they had the Ticonderga, I never say it right, erasers in the 15 count pack. Or you could also get the um, bookends in the four different colors that have the laser cutout that says inspire. Or you could also get them that say read. I also found this 100 count pack of the Office Mate paper clips. And then they had the magnetic letters and numbers back in this week. That's a full sh sheet and you get quite a few of each letter and number. Then they had the to-do list, which are the magnetic that come with the dry erase marker that has the eraser on the end. There's four different ones. They sell these from time to time. Uh, they've actually been carrying these most of the time as like a staple in their office supply section. They used to just put them out from time to time, but I've seen them out for quite a while now. They had some more of the weekly planners in the Crown Jewels brand. It is 40 sheets, and uh, as you can see, it has like a, a spot for each day of the week, so you can fill those out. They also had some color by number activity books. Um, they had so much just like llamas, sloths, like different animals, alligators, like dinosaurs and things like that. Then you could also get the characters like Dora. They had um, Paw Patrol and things like that. So like I said, it comes with the markers 
And then it has all the color by number. And that's a great learning tool for small kids. They just think they're coloring, but they're learning at the same time. I used to use these all the time when I homeschooled uh, my kids years ago when they were little. Then I found a bunch of different craft books, like how to make polymer clay charms. They also had some gardening books and a few different books for doing um, like sewing. They had knitting, crocheting. There's quite a few different craft books that they had out this week. And they also had some chapter books and the Monster High brand for uh, children. So over in the party supplies this week, they had quite a few new things. I was surprised how much of the party supplies they've been getting so many new things recently. Last week, I showed you guys the treat sacks that say best day ever. The pink one here with the triangles. They also had the one with the black and white stripes. But this week, I found one more. It's the burlap with the white polka dots i just thought those were so cute i just love those i know they're going really quickly then they had these 40 count pack of miniature cubes those are just a dollar you get 40 and then the shark uh party pack here with the different plates they also had the eat dessert new party set here which was new to go along with the shark things each week they seem to be adding more to the set and then i found this really gorgeous set here with the different flowers down the side and they had quite a few different sets of decorative napkins with the metallic stars you could also get the uh, really bright vibrant like stripes they had those in quite a few different colors and they also had some with the different like paisleys and things on them and they had quite a few uh, different colors of those as well they also had the dc superhero girls candle sets last week i showed you guys they had the dinosaurs this week they have the superheroes and then they also have some more of the glitter candles in a new color they have them in the black i also found some new party decor for baby showers i love this one with the little swan that says welcome baby they had the napkins cake plates and food plates or you could also get the it's a baby girl with the clothesline here they had those as well i found some really pretty uh tissue paper and the tank count pack here just absolutely gorgeous with the flowers and the soft pinks and purples and they had a whole bunch of these large bows with the candy stripes on them you could get them in pink red a light blue green and they also had them in yellow and those all had the white stripes they also had these colorful fillers they have a little box on the side to show you how they work so it comes like in a big spiral it's flat and then all you do is lift it up and then you get all these little spirals that you can fill a bag with i thought those were really neat they also had some new gift wrap which is really pretty it's the natural paper with a um like a metallic look to it that says like hip hip hooray in the pink these are some gold stripes. This one here just has a gold decorative pattern. And then the um, dark blue polka dots. They had the light blue stars. And then the last one here, which was just the iridescent silver stripes. They also had some new photo prop sets. Some of them, it says you can design your own. So there's quite a few in there um, where you're able to write on them to personalize them. And here's just a view of the few that you could see. They also had these extra large balloon garlands, which were new. I just love these. It goes 12 inches long, comes with the balloons and everything you need to create it. So you get 10 balloons. Uh, and then they had that other pack there. They also had this new balloon clip, which I actually just posted a video because today was my daughter's birthday. And I wanted to show you guys how those work. I actually had another video planned, which I'll just show you guys next week in sticks. I really wanted to try out the balloon clips. They also brought back out the balloon glue and they had these new um, place card holders in the wedding section. They're these hearts with little rhinestones on them. And then it's got the little metal like curly cue thing at the top that you could put the place cards. You could even use them to put pictures and things on. They had some new gift bags in the wedding section as well that says love with the little blue truck. And then I just love these new bags that they have. So they have one that has the lemons, watermelon you can get uh the oranges and then this one has like the lime lemon and grapefruit sections i just thought those were so cute they're absolutely gorgeous they're bright and colorful then the pet care not a whole lot new this week they mostly just had these new toys which all resemble different food items 
My dog's small, he's a Pomeranian, but even he can chew through these, so I'm not sure how safe these toys are, but I did just want to show you guys what was out there, but just be careful if you get them for your dog, watch and make sure that they're not able to completely chew through them and end up eating them. Over in the seasonal department, a few new items this week, some restock items like the yard stakes that are the stars with the stars and stripes on them. You get the stripes going in different directions. They're all painted a little bit different. They also were putting out this box of the red, white, and blue mums and carnations. Um, a few of the Dollar Trees, they had a whole wall of the carnations already filled in. And the red, white, and blue, they had these novelty pens, which are the um, pom-poms at the top there. You can get them in the red, white, or blue that all have the pom-pom on the top. Last week, I showed you guys they had the patriotic bandanas. Um, this week, they had some new ones out. They had a little bit more of like a rustic look to the flag. And the stars there, it wasn't quite so um, cartoonish looking to me so i kind of like those a lot and they had these extra large um tote bags those match the scarves that they've had out the last few months um so it was nice to see the bags they haven't had the, these out at the dollar tree until now at least i don't remember i don't think i've posted these yet and then they also had the paper lanterns uh that light up and you get one of those for a dollar it takes two triple a batteries which you do have to buy then they had some of the coastal tablecloths with like lighthouses, the lobsters, and things like that. That's the first time I've seen those out at the Dollar Tree this year. They also had their felt shapes, which was the starfish. They had the crab and the clamshell, and they also had um, the large sun. Some of them have glitter on them, and then some of them are just two-toned. It depends. Every Dollar Tree seems to just get different ones. Some of them always seem to have glitter on them then other ones seem to just get the plain ones i don't know uh what the difference is there so they also have the mason jar signs this blue one here is new these ones i showed you guys last week with the strawberries and watermelon and things on them they also had these new signs that say sweet summer with the glitter on top for the ice cream cones they're quite large i only found them in the pink they don't have them in any other colors then they brought back these like hello summer signs and the it's five o'clock somewhere. These are a restock item. I know I saw these last year. They might have already had them out earlier this year. And this is just like a restock item that they just were putting back out. Some of the um, melanine plates and things. Um, I don't know if these are just from last year they had left over. Or if they are putting out some new ones. Because... Um, they have some new ones with the seashells on them, but they're all blue. And the same with the flamingos. They had the new one, and then that other one looks like the ones they had out last year. They also had some of the H2O water squirters that have the animals at the top. They had some sharks and some alligators. And then they also started putting out some fall items. So they had the gather cups with the pumpkins on them and then out front at two of the dollar trees i went to this week they had a ton of their fall flowers they had the glitter feathers um the uh cotton some of them had the um pine cones with the cotton and as you could see all the little sprigs there with the um glitter on them the cattails and then they have all the different fall colors, like the oranges. Some have pumpkins on them and the sunflowers. They even had the um, the like bluish green colored ones with the white pumpkins attached with the pine cones, which were a restock from last year. There's the large ferns with the glitter on them. And then they have these ones, which are a little bit different of a style. And those are covered in glitter as well and all the different fall colors. As you can see, they just had a lot of the fall flowers. I was really surprised to see them. It was almost 100 today in, te in Texas. That's about the hottest we've got so far this year. So we've been pretty lucky. But when you see these fall items and it's this hot outside, it just seems crazy to me. I grew up in Ohio, so it's a little bit weird to see fall items when it's about 100 degrees outside. So as you can see, they have quite a few um of the fall items out now um a lot of them looked like repeats i didn't really see anything that 
really stood out to me as brand new. So it looks like a lot of fall will be repeat items this year, at least in the floral department. Then inside the store, they had these small bags from Room Bloom, and it's got the small seeds that look like pumpkins, which I love. I love to use those in crafting. So they had the orange ones, the green ones, and they had some that were red covered in glitter. And then it comes with a bunch of the pine cones. They also had the burlap ribbon in the fall colors as well. Over in Toys, Games, and Entertainment, they had these three different little purses in the pink and white, or you could get them in the purple and white. And they're all filled with about six, seven, eight different plastic pieces. And um, they look like little nail polishes and things like that. They also had these splat toys. Um, they had quite a few of them. Maybe there's four or five different ones. And um, they look like different animals or robots and things like that. In the toy department, you could also get the PJ Mask figurine. So they had Luna Girl. They also had Gecko. This one is Owlette. The Night Ninja. Catboy. And they had Romeo. I also found their watering cans for kids. Those are fun. They sell those every summer. You could also get the Dr. Seuss one fish, two fish puzzle. They also had some shape puzzles, which were fun. So they had a My Little Pony. You could get the Disney Princess, which is a heart-shaped puzzle. The Blue's Clues is a star shape. Minnie Mouse is a bow. And then the Trolls World Tour, the shape of that puzzle is a heart. Then in the Dollar Tree Plus section, which is at select stores only, the items are either going to be three or five dollars. They had these new Guardian Galaxy beach towels. They're the um, regular sized beach towel. And they also had these new towels, which were the five dollar Barbarian brand. These are huge. They are 40 by 70 inches. They are absolutely ginormous and they weigh a ton. As a great buy for five dollars, so they would be a lot more than that anywhere else. They also had these Zoom Zoom towels for five dollars, and you could get um, the can coolers restocked. They had them in red, green, black, and blue for three dollars. You could get the Star Wars figurines. Those are by Hasbro. There are four different ones that they had at the Dollar Tree this week. You could also get these windmill bubbles. Uh, those were $3 and then they had these shelves with the hooks on them that you could hang things on as well as set things on the shelf. It's an 18 inch shelf by Bella Living. And that's it for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please check out some of our crafting videos. We post those every Thursday and we try to use mainly items from the Dollar Tree. And of course we post our Dollar Tree videos to see what is new for the week each and every Friday. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share if you enjoyed this video and here are those other videos from our channel you might also enjoy. Have a great weekend, everyone. Stay safe.